road to Dallas. The finals of the NCAA basketball playoffs begin today. Robert Elliott reports from Baton Rouge on one of the underdogs. Here we go, 10 seconds counting down. Solney brings it up. The good news is that tiny Marist College won its conference championship and a first ever trip to the NCAA tournament. Marist has won the ECAC Metro Championship. They're going to the NCAA. They can't believe it. They can't, the guys that play with in high school, they can't believe it. They're like, they can't believe it. The bad news is they got to face fifth ranked slam dunking Georgia Tech in the first round. The game should be a real David and Goliath affair. For Georgia Tech, it's supposed to be just a tune-up on the way to the finals. Tiny Maris College hopes to take advantage of that overconfidence. If they win, it could be the upset of the year. Now, everyone loves to root for an underdog, but at the Southeast Regionals in Baton Rouge, there's one problem. No one's ever heard of Marist. Where is Marist? I have no idea. How do you spell Marist? I have no idea. Have you ever heard of Marist? No, never. <laughs> Maris coach Matt Progenic finds the team's no-name status amusing. I think you might be the Ronnie Dangerfield syndrome uh, as far as, you know, getting no respect, but I think once you get there, you do get respect. The tip-off is later this afternoon. Georgia Tech against Marist. That's Marist, M-A-R-I-S-T. Robert Elliott, NBC News, Baton Rouge. Now we've all heard of Marist. Coming up.